Now you might ask, well, wait a minute, virgin birth. Well, here's the answer there. The word, the word here for virgin, and this is another thing that they argue with. The, first of all, the woman may have been a virgin until, until obviously it says, it says, it says then she, got, she conceived with a man's help. She wasn't a virgin afterwards, okay? But she's a sign for the one who will be a virgin and will conceive by God, okay? So this is all a shadow of, it happened then, but it's a shadow of something greater that is going to happen later. But the other thing is that they'll go with this and they'll say, well, well, it says, a, you say a virgin shall conceive. They'll argue that the Hebrew word doesn't really mean virgin. It means young maiden. This is another argument. And the Hebrew word virgin wasn't used. So what's the answer to that? Well, they'll say there's another Hebrew word that means always virgin, betula, and this one is not. This one is the word alma. Let's try it, alma. Alma, they'll say, doesn't mean virgin, means maiden, young maiden. Well, it does mean young maiden, but it means particularly an unmarried woman. They'll say, well, it doesn't say virgin. No, no. The Alma is, when it's used in the Bible, is a virgin. Because if it's not a virgin, she's in big trouble. Because she's not married. Okay? The initial thing. So any verse that speaks about this, the is speaking about, it's a maiden, but she is also a virgin. Now, now, actually, the word between the other word, betula, which, mean, which, al which also means a maiden, and it refers to a virgin, the am is actually stronger, meaning a virgin between the two. Now, now here's the thing. Now, a, a few things about this. The word, when it talks about Rebecca uh, it, as a virgin, it says she was a betula, she's a virgin. But in other places it speaks about, in, in Genesis 24, when it says the maidens come forth like Rebecca to draw water, the word is Alma. So both words are used inter, pretty much interchangeably. Hi, I'm Jonathan Kahn, and I hope you were blessed with the video. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and tap the bell icon so you're notified every time a new video is posted. Feel free to share your reactions with your comments and how you were blessed, and share this video with your friends. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.